Hello, this is Diamond Sword 08, and I'm going to be showing you my Toxtricity VMAX deck that I have on the Pokemon Trading Card Game Online. It's a very fun one, and it's pretty consistent. I'll talk you through how each card of the deck works, and then just play some games with it. Also, this is going to be my first time like recording to the face cam, so let me know what you think. So the main engine of the deck is Toxtricity VMAX, as you already know, getting 3 energy on it so I can use GMAX right and do 160 or 240 if it poisons. I have the promo Toxtricity V because sometimes you just need to use Energize. Most of the time you'll just be using this and the Electric Riot can be used if you're in a pinch, 90 and then 180 if it's poisoned. Uh, to get the poison, you we use the Garbodor. I have a 3-2 line of that. And it has the ability Poisonous Puddle, where it poisons your opponent's active Pokemon if there's a stadium play. And I do play some stadiums. Oh yeah, and I forgot to mention, 3-3 three, three line of Toxtricity V and VMAX. 2 for Toxtricity V Normal, 1 for the promo. Bolt on V is there to set up using the Electrify attack to get some of the energy onto Bench Toxtricity V. So the next turn you could evolve into VMAX, attach, retreat, bolt on V with either a switch or an air balloon, and then just get going. Zigzagoon is there to like hit the numbers, Eldegoss is self-explanatory, serves the two to Dene GXs, you need draw support. Tapu Koko is for uh, in case, it's like I usually end up using it in case I don't have time to use bolt on to set up a toxicity like mid or late game. Tapu Fini's there because Blacephalon is annoying, although I'm considering taking this out for a fourth Pokemon communication. Anyways, the energy I have, six basic lightning energy, four speed lightning energy. Speed lightning energy is essential to your draw support for attaching energy. You usually will be attaching that to Bolton V so you can use Electrify. Uh, I only have ten energy because that's usually all I need. Electro Power, same thing as Zigzagoon, helps hit the numbers. Evolution Incense is good for searching out with Volkner so I can get the Toxtricity VMAX out. Pokemon Communication and Quick Ball are my Pokemon search. Stadium Nav, same as Evolution Incense, helps you grab a Dust Island or a Thunder Mountain if you need it. Switch for switching Pokemon, though Air Balloon is also for switching Pokemon because everything here has either one or two retreat costs, so it's very helpful. I usually attach it to Boltund or a Garbodor. Dust Island, because when I tried Power Plant, I kept on accidentally putting down to Dene GX underneath it. So, yeah, Dust Island. I haven't really used it that much. It's a good card for in case you need to. Thunder Mountain Prism Star is self explanatory. It's for in case you can't get that third energy on or you can't get an energy on Boltund. Boss's Order is easy, gusting. Cynthia and Professor Research are my draw supporters. Volkner's for energy search and getting out key item cards when I need them, like Evolution Incense, Stadium Nav, Quick Ball, etc. Air balloons for switching. And, uh, yeah, that's everything. I think I might have gone a bit too fast. If I have, let me know. And so, yeah, let's get into some games. Okay, so we are up against Lambo Valgolona123. I wasn't really paying attention to the types. For this deck, you usually want to go second, so you can get off that turn one Electrify. Um, and when searching out Pokemon, you always want to go in this order. Toxtricity, Bolton, Trubbish. You can live without Poison, but you can't live without a Toxtricity. Here, this is, uh, this is an okay hand. We can communication this Toxtricity VMAX to grab a Toxtricity V, and then I can use research, although it pains me so much to discard two electro powers. Okay, looks like they're getting out a Jirachi. Is this like, um, what is, oof, discarding Shaman, you know, you don't want to do that. Is this, uh, some grass box or something? I don't know. They're probably searching for a Rowleg. Tag Team Rowlet and a Lola Executive. Oh, they just conceded. Okay. That was odd. Let's, uh, try this again. Okay, now we're up against Sora Sky OMG. I have the advantage, even though they have a fighting deck and we're weak to that. Ooh, that's a fancy coin. Uh, I won, and I will be going second. 
as I usually will with this deck. Uh, ooh, this is perfect, actually. I can uh, start Boltund and then have Toxtricity Bench, Quick Ball, something for possibly... I don't really want to discard anything. I'll probably end up discarding the Pokemon Communication or t the top deck or something off the Speed Lightning to get a Trubbish, and then I'll just Electrify. Or I could uh, even Cynthia and see what else I get. Yeah, this is a great start. Looks like we're up against Spiritum, some fighting version of Spiritum. I don't remember. I don't. I don't think this is Drill Tomb because I don't remember Ross's list playing Jirachis. So this is definitely a Spiritum deck because I see the Jinx. Probably gonna grab that that off the quick off the Stellar Wish, or they're going to do something else. Maybe this is Spiritomb Beasts. I don't know. For Spiritomb, you do want to evolve into VMAX just so you can have the HP advantage. Anyways, what are they going to get? They get another Quick Ball. Are they going to Quick Ball the Quick Ball? Oh, I didn't. I forgot to say hello. How rude of me. Okay, they're discarding a boss's orders. What are they getting? A Spiritomb. Knew it. No, it, no, it, no, it. Um, what else? I usually don't talk while doing this, but since this is video, I need to talk, otherwise you'll just get bored and go away. Okay, quick, using that other quick ball, discarding a karate belt. Interesting. I don't play much of Spiritomb, but they usually play Hustle Belt. So, what is this? I have leg legitimately no clue. <clears throat> Looks like they don't have an energy, which is good. Means they can't. Uh, uh, means. Bleh, means they can't get an extra damage, but. Why did I move it to the Jinx? I don't play Spirit Tomb, I don't know these things. Maybe they misclicked. Okay, there's a Garbodor. We can use that. Okay, I'll do that. Um. I think I'll just quick ball this communication like I said I was I'm going to grab a trubbish. I'm not going to synth I'm not going to play supporter anymore because I have Garbodor in hand. So yeah, not much I'm going to be doing this turn, just using that electrify to get those oh god, I prized three basic at lightning energy. What what is in here? So prized one a, a speed lightning, prized three of these, that means Five energy total. I was lucky to have that starting. Uh, nothing. Tapu Fini's. Uh, I don't think I'll need the Tapu Fini. Although I might if the Spirit Tomb Beasts. Okay, everything's okay. Um, yeah. What is in my print? Looks like. Uh, Looks like uh, Professor's Research got prized. I play 3-3 three, three each. And then what was my sixth one? Uh, I don't know. I'll have to figure it out later. All I know is I know five of my six prizes and three of them are basic lightning energy. That does not bode well for getting a Toxtricity VMAX set up next turn. I'll have to dig for a Stadium Nav, possibly. And I need to dig for an air balloon. Stellar wishing. Getting a great ball. Okay, what are they doing here? Okay. Digging for an energy? Or probably just digging for a draw supporter. <laughs> I don't... Yep, there's the professor's research. I'm sure they're going to do that at some point during this turn. They're going to Great Ball first. A Terrakian? What? I'm uh, okay. I'm so confused. What kind of Spirit Doom is this? Oh, that's problematic. I get it now. If all of your benched Pokemon have at least one damage... Oh! I get it. 
there's a Diancie. Oof. I totally get this now. And it's terrifying. I'm gonna have to figure out... I'm gonna figure out a way to get rid of that Terrakian before long. Um... Maybe if I... No, even if I do top deck bosses, I can't really do much. Unless I am able to, uh, Dene into a one. I want to get rid of that Teraki and it scares me. There's a twin energy. That means they just need a fighting energy. That Teraki on is scary. Very scary. And there's another one. I didn't know it was a promo. Cool. Gonna evolve that always. And then, looks like I'm just having to Cynthia, because I don't want to discard those Electra powers. But I also need a new hand. Okay? There's a Dust Island. I want that out. I can Quick Ball. I don't think I need Electra power, honestly. Because this is Spirit Tomb. Quick Ball Electra power to get. You know what? Doesn't matter. I'll get Toxtricity. And then Communication. That Toxtricity to get the VMAX, because I need the VMAX out. I shouldn't have played Dust Island. Oh well. And now I'll Quick Ball the Cynthia and grab a Dene GX. Where are they? So I can keep digging. See, I need an air balloon and an energy. There's energy. Uh, no air balloon. Which sucks. Very much sucks. But I have a quick ball. I'll get rid of this trubbish since I don't need it. To just grab another Toxtricity V. How much energy? Only one basic energy. Just so I can put this down and do something useful. Electrify here. <coughs> okay. I very much do not like this Terrakian right here. It's very scary. And they're going to jinx to this Terrakian. Attach, retreat, and then knock out my bolt end. And then I'll knock them out with... VMAX. Or Rainbow Energy, that works too. Stellar Wishing, because I don't see a reason not to Stellar Wishing. I don't know why the game said I had an advantage. I obviously don't. I didn't realize. Oh god. Why? Well, I guess this is kind of a Spirit Tomb deck. Just like this weird one that plays Terrakian. Doing 200 damage, that's crazy. Yeah. Am I moving around too much? I probably am. Uh, yep. And goodbye, Boltund. It was nice knowing you. Or may wait, maybe he doesn't want to knock it out, because then I can just knock him out, and then he doesn't have another attacker for that can knock me out in one hit for a bit. Yep, he just does. 400, just like I predicted. There's two prize cards. Out goes the VMAX. Hmm... You always want to poison. Never forget to poison. I've done it multiple times, and it was bad. What do I need to grab off this? Um, I don't know what I need to get, honestly. I think I'll just get an air balloon off this. Put it on the Garbodor. So I can have Pivot Point. I don't know if I evolve or not, either. I mean... 
do I? I don't, I, no, I'm not going to. You know what? I'm going to. And then I'm going to Dedene because, okay, just missing in energy. I'll touch this air balloon to, I don't know. No, I'm not going to. I'll wait. G-Max Riot. There, please be an energy. Yes, I got an energy. I can use this Toxicity V-Max now. If I can just dig out that one speed landing energy from there, then I can win. Or actually, I could get uh, this knocked out. Oh, wait, I have. I know what I'm going to get with this Volkner. Uh, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to uh, Volkner this tap. I'm going to Volkner grab a quick ball. Quick ball, discard this to get Tapu Koko Prism Star. That way I can uh, get this attached and then still be able to attach Speed Lightning if I have to. Even though I rather would not. What are you going to do, Mr. or Mrs.? I don't know. What are you going to do, weird? Budget. I, I don't even know what to call this deck. Anyways, uh, a hundred plus the house about one sixty. Quick balling Cynthia to get Tarakian Jinx Spiritum. Okay, Jinx, which makes sense. You need more ways to spread that damage around. But are you going to bench it? You can't charge up your um. Wait, do I have a bosses in the discard? No, I don't. Which is unfortunate. Because I would like... Oh, okay, Marnie. That's quite rude of you. There's Tapu Koko Prism Star. I can put that down if I need to. Martial Arts Dojo. There's... uh. There's the Unit Energy Fighting Dark Fairy, FDR, uh, 120, 130 plus Hustle Belt, that's 190, 190, that's 220 damage with that Spear Tomb, which is a lot. Ugh, gotta stretch. There's a Shrine of Punishment, which you cannot use, because you already put out your Martial Arts Dojo today. Not today, this turn. Hello, Mr. 220 Damage Spiritum. I am afraid of you. I, I was right. That is quite a lot of damage. I'll put down this Tapu Koko Prism Star and Cynthia. Oh, there's a boss is for next turn. I can attach this air balloon to something. Oh, what? I, I don't. I don't know what to attach this air balloon to. Um, I think I'll. First, I'm going to. No, I'm going to Stadium Nav. <sighs> Why? Why does this always happen? I always get, like, two tails with this thing. It's so annoying. Poisonous Puddle. I'm tempted to just pass. Nah. Um, yes, it's another energy. Okay, it looks like I won't need Tapu Koko after all. Oh well. Let's see, 20, 30, 2 from the Jinxes makes it 30, plus Building Spite is 40, 
40 plus hustle belt and rainbow. You could do another 220 if they got rainbow belt. Not rainbow belt. Rainbow energy. They need a hustle belt. Although, honestly, just right now they're doing enough damage to knock out my toxicity VMAX. Ooh, gold shine. That's fancy. Wait, why does this say alternate art? Where do you get these? This is a very interesting game, to say the least. Oh, on the bright side, they're attaching every turn because I keep knocking out their spare tombs. So they don't have time to charge up Tarakian. I guess that's the downside to playing a two, playing this thing. You don't have any energy acceleration. Just attach in every turn. The bosses. What are you... Are you going to use it? I, I doubt it. They have exactly what they need up here. A damage toxicity VMAX that they can just knock out with the spirit tomb. Yep. With the 10 extra damage from Angry. Yeah, that's enough. Let's. Two. That'll bring them down to one prize. Um, oh, what the heck, why not? Dance of the Ancients, these two. Retreat. Poisonous Puddle first. Then Retreat. With the air balloon to this. Um, I'll put an air balloon on this too. Why not? And then I'll... G-Max Riot. I don't really have anything else to do. I just have to be very terrified. How many spirit tombs have I knocked out? There's the last energy. Two. They still have two more in deck. The Shrine of Punishment is going to be no annoying. I need to... How many stadiums have I discarded? Both my Dust Islands and my Stadium Nav didn't work, so... There's Rainbow Energy on Tarakian. It means they're not charging up a Spear Tomb, which is good, because then I can bosses up that Tarakian and knock it out. What are they going to do? Okay, now they have four spear tomb back if they play four, which I'm assuming they do. Can't ordinary rod, basic energy, and you don't have any in your discard. I've been thinking about adding ordinary rod in here. It's definitely an option if you want to. Um, like adding an ordinary rod instead of that Tapu Fini. I haven't really been seeing much Blacephalon. Play. They play two jinx? Three jinx, I mean? Huh. I think I'll end up just for taking out that for a... For a, I think I'll take out, ta take out Tapu Fini for Ordinary Rod if you're going to build this. Jinx. Ominous Posture. Retreating to Jinx. Sacrificing the Jinx. Uh huh. I don't think so, says Boss's orders. Uh, off this Jinx to that Jinx? What? I would assume you'd move it off the Spirit Tomb. Because then it can just add another one. Okay. Passing. Let's, um,. Attach here, evolve into my third Toxicity VMAX. I don't know why. 
And then bosses up that Terrakian. Because that's really like the only threat here. Uh, you must always poison, even if it feels unnecessary. Always poison. And just knock out their army. So it doesn't terrify me as much. There's a Reese. There's the research. Seriously. I... Ugh, they start loading up that Terrakian again. I can Elder Goss, grab this, and just bosses it up and kill it. Looks like they are. And I don't like that. Oh, I think I know what they're doing. They're charging up that uh, Spirit Tomb, so they have two attackers. Spirit Tomb only needs one energy. What? I don't get this. Oh, sorry if I just shook the camera. Hurry up. Okay. Stellar wishing. Um, getting a great ball. Although I don't know what they grab. GX and use it. Although they, they, there's another spirit tomb. Um, you see these sorts of interesting decks on the bottom of the ladder. I just haven't been playing that much. And there's the sacrificial jinx, which you will not you will not get to use. Man, this shrine of punishment is annoying. Uh, okay, I'm going to Eldegoss, grab bosses. I say you are not charging up that Terrakian. Yeah, they're sad. They are sad. Oh, I want to attach this to somewhere for some reason. Uh, I'll just uh, G Max Riot, I guess. Don't I'm not really doing much on these turns. I don't have anything to set up. Speed Lightning. Okay. My Dedenes are at a hundred health. This is bad. I wonder how many bosses orders they play. They've already discarded. Uh, I swear they discarded one. Yes, they did. There's the spiritual. They can get the fifty damage. They can get the two twenty. But I think I think I won, unless they have another bosses. The only way I can see them winning is if they have a bosses orders. If they have bosses, they win. If they don't, I win. This is intense. I'm super nervous right now. Come on, don't have bosses. Don't have bosses. Don't have bosses. Don't have bosses. Don't have bosses orders. They've got energy. Okay. Okay, so they've used both ominous postures. I think. What did I get off that? A switch. Do they have bosses? Big reveal moment. I wish there, I swear, I wish there was a question mark. Ah. They do. Oh well. That was a good game. All in all, that was a very interesting game. I've never seen it before. What is this deck? Three, four Tarakian, four Spiritum, three Jirachi, three Buzzwool, and they do play a Dedenne. They got their scoop of nets, quick balls. All in all, a very interesting deck that they played. That is cool. Anyways. I don't know. That was, uh, crazy. I'm gonna go add an ordinary rod. Okay, next game, except this time I have an ordinary rod instead of a Tapu Fini. And this is only grass type. They're probably gonna... 
probably going to go second because they want they want that uh yeah they want to use this raw and lin executor's super growth attack so uh I don't have anywhere to switch, do I? Yeah, I think I'll quick ball the Pokemon communication, grab Volton, and then I can't play supporter, so I think I just will attach to here and then just be done. Okay, yeah. It's annoying when you can't go second, but. It's usable. Marnie? Okay. I don't mind that. Because, uh... Ooh, perfect air balloon. Oops. I can attach the speed lightning here. Air balloon here. Retreat. Bolt on. I'll, uh... Play Volkner. Grab evolution incense and this lightning energy. Because I do want to grab a Toxtricity VMAX. Um, as I said, that is more important than... I probably should have left that in there. Oh well. As I said, getting Toxtricity VMAX is way more important than getting out of Garbodor. Next turn I'll attach to uh, Bolton. There's a Rillaboom. There's the turf field stadium. Oh my god, I'm super scared of Tropical Hour GX. It's going to be so annoying if they're able to... Good. Wait. Do we the super growth? Evolving into a Thwacky and then... And then the Rillaboom. Okay. I'm gonna put out this Toxtricity V. Put out Thunder Mountain. Attach this here. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18. I'll be doing 190 with Bolt Storm. I can't really do anything else. Well, I mean, I could electrify, but what good would that do me? I'm just gonna bolt. No, wait. Do I? But do I want to electrify, though? I don't know. Electrify will set me up a second toxicity, but Bolt Storm will allow me to. Wait. 90 plus 190 plus 160 is. Oh, en enough to KO that. Yeah. Also, uh, yeah. And then. If I can, I'll be able to take it out with Bolt Hunt if they uh, don't knock me out with Chop. Really? That's annoying. They got their VMAX out. Who are they going to attach to? Rowleg or Rillaboom? Okay, I see. Setting up for Tropical Hour GX, I see. My cock will go on. No! I'm gonna just look through my deck. No, I don't have a way to get out of this. I think I'm just gonna electrify. I have to. <sighs> it's annoying. Attach one to here. One, two, three, four. <sighs> Great. Ah. <sighs> 
I'd be doing 1 5th, 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21. I, I can do 2. Yep. That's how I put out the second bolt end. So I can hopefully start setting up next turn. Yes, Cynthia top deck. And there's a speed lightning. Um, air balloon. I'm gonna Pokemon communication this Toxtricity V Max to get a Garbodor because I want that out. Um, and then I'll just uh do an Electrify. Ah, I forgot to poison. I should have poisoned. That way, I that way I could have. Uh, at least slightly negate the healing from calming hurricane. Anyways, I've got a knockout on this thing next turn. Milo. Milo, that's interesting. What do they do? what did they discard? Cook ball and thwacky. That's annoying. Is this sort of like an energy denial deck? Okay. Time to bada boom, bada bing. What did I just? How did this? How did this get on here? I have no clue how that got there. I swear. I don't have anything I want a quick ball for, so I'll Cynthia. Um. I think this is good for now, and now and then I'll just G Max Riot. Could I have attached that lightning energy? I hope not. Because if I did, that would be um extremely dumb. Well, there's Max beating. I could have attached that lightning energy, that would have been so dumb. <sighs> Let me just double check. Yeah, I couldn't have, because I attached it to this thing. There's a turf training court, not turf field. Bosses. The guard? Oh. Obviously. That gets rid of my poison. Unfortunately for you. I have Galarian Zigzagoon. Which means I can two shot you with. Um also I have an electric power. Do I do I have basic lightnings in my discard pile? No. Okay. I'll do this. Electro power. And then to Dana to get that lightning energy in the discard pile. So I can tapu coco. Easily or Huh, easier. Okay. Dance of the Ancients to these two. And then I can Volkner if I need to. And I'll put down the Trubbish, why not? Yeah, that's one of the things about Toxtricity is that your bench gets full very quickly. Uh. Okay. You now have 130 HP left. And I have bosses too. Actually, this is kind of perfect. I think I. Uh, are you kidding me? Really? You had to Marnie. 
Oh, well. Actually, that's even better, because I got two lightning energies. I'll say you have a good deck, just to be polite. And he conceded. Yeah, I would have won against him anyway. That was uh, fun, though. I'm curious. I always, I always like looking at their deck lists afterward. Two Rowleg, so that was pretty good that they started with it. Two of these. Uh, so two, two, three, no, three, three, three line of the Thwackies and Rillabooms. They had only two, two Remax. Interesting. Three Pokegear, three Switch, three Quick Ball, four Crushing Hammer, a Tag Switch. I mean, that does kind of make sense. Four Ordinary Rod. This is a... I never pictured playing it like this, with, like, Milo's and all that. Uh, okay, ten grass. Okay, that that's fun. That's a fun deck. Okay, now uh, let's go one more game, just to show you. Also, because I want those 75 Pokey coins, trainer tokens, whatever they're called. Okay, Dark Steel Psychic Electric. I lost the coin flip. Hello. Okay. This is good. Ooh, bolt on start. And two toxicities and a Volkner. This is going very well. I'll keep uh, this in hand so I can communication it for a... Okay, there's Dragapult. That's fun. So we're up against Dragapult, eh? Cool. Um... Dragapult's kind of a good matchup because you're two-shotting them and they're three-shotting you. But they can spread damage, which is annoying. Let's see. What's the max amount of damage I can do with this deck? 240 plus 6 Lagoon is 250. 250 260, 270, 280, 290, 300, 310, 320, 30. So, if I had two Electro Powers and a Zigzag... Wait, what? They just conceded... That's no fun. What? That's not fair. No, boo. Boo. Okay, let's try that again. Okay, this is the real last game. But as I was saying, I think with two Electro Powers, I can uh, knock out a Dragapult. Or maybe it's two Electro Powers plus Zigzagoon. I don't remember. Anyways, Electric Steel. I'm just going to go heads for once, and then it's going to be tails. And then they'll get to choose again, because that's just how things go. But they're going to go first, that's good. That's another epic start. I seem to have those a lot here. I'm not going to bench Tapu Koko. I think I'll save the Thunder Mountain. Okay, so they have Metal Saucer, Switch, Chaotic Swell, Sonya, and three Metal Energies. Which tells me this is some sort of metal deck. Either... Kaparaja V Max or Zation. I'm betting Zation because that's better than Kaparaja. Eh. I love the art on this full art bolt on V, and I always seem to get it, even though I only have one. Yes, I'd like to draw a card. No, it's a Zation deck, but is it ADP Zation? Or is it Combo Zation or whatever? I don't know. Anyways, it's the Tin Zation V for sure, and. What I know is that I don't like that art that much. But don't tell anyone. Don't want to insult them. It's ADPZ. Got it. There's what, the water energy. For this, you generally just want to um, knock out their ADP. Yeah, knock out their ADP ASAP. Speed. Uh, Trubbish. This is the like the perfect thing, the most perfect ever. For this, I say don't bench too many vulnerable Pokemon. Like, but except for the things you like, absolutely have to, so they can't take advantage of it. Here I'm just going normal strategy. I can attach that Speed Lightning and hopefully grab a V Max off that, or uh. Or an air balloon, or both. 
Air Balloon, Toxtricity, VMAX would be epic. Boo. That's mean. But I have Thunder Mountain, so it's no big deal. I think they're having a hard time deciding. They they chose that one. Fools. You are a fool. I have Tabu Coco and Thunder Mountain. Okay, there's Metal Goggles. I'm just going to take that as 350 HP, which I can still knock out. Because Poison. I technically do 150, 250, not, 250 with the Poison damage. Malolana, there's the Altered Creation GX. And there's a Metal Saucer. Okay, there's Altered Creation now. Air Balloon. Speed Lightning. Uh... Garboder. Um. I'm gonna just do this. Like, as a fail safe. Um, I'm going to Electro Power, because you kind of need to do that with this. Um, let's see. What could I do with Bolt Storm, actually? 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 160. Not enough. I need one hit. Dig, 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 dig. Do I want to bench this? I'll just do it. I'll just do it. 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 Yes, 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 yes. And remember, you... Poisoning is absolutely essential in this. Yes, there's the knockout. There's the turn 2 ADP knockout. That's what I love to see. Absolutely. Thank you for saying well played. You're being a good sport. Oh man, I wasn't sure if I was going to get that. And then I drew two Toxtricity VMAX off that to Dene. 100% worth it. Oh god, that was uh <sighs> nerve wracking. And I love how we w it was a good sport about it too. Well played. Yes, well played indeed. Uh, okay, getting. They're probably getting an illusion, because they already did that. Oh, an Oranguru. An Oranguru. What is that card in their hand, I wonder? They have the Oranguruization, and then I have like this full bench, this full board of things. Okay, yeah. I wanted to play it safe with the Tapu Koko, which was a good idea. Intrepid Sword. You, you realize I can just knock you out this turn. Yeah, he does. That's why he's going well played. I like this opponent. They're very, uh, considerate. I'm just gonna go, you have a good deck. They just, uh, where it was, it was a bit unfortunate. Um. Do 10. Poison will knock it out, like they did with ADP. And then they just have Orangu. I don't see how they can get back from this. Oh, my rain. I haven't seen this in a bit. My full art boss's orders. Yeah. I don't have that many full art things, but I have a few like the uh, full art toxicities and the full art bosses in this. That's like about it. Acrobikes. I actually opened up a bunch of Rebel Clash packs uh, yesterday. You should check that video out. I'll link it. Ooh, Gold Station. That's fancy. And Dene. Looks like they got that. <sighs> if they can wait, how many metal saucer do they have? If they somehow got two metal saucer off that, then they could go to at least do some damage. I want them to be able to play this out. <laughs> I feel bad for them. Oh well, oh well. Anyways, that's what you should do. Definitely do against ADP station. What I just did. I'm glad I got to do a meta deck as the final game.
I'm just going to end it right now quickly. No, I wanna no, I'm not. I'm going to flex my full art boss's orders. Ah that was a mistake. Oh well. I guess I did say I wanted to give them a chance. Oh well. Andrew C four twenty, if you're watching this, hello. If you're watching this in the future after I've recorded and posted it. Hello. Now you know why I did that. I misplayed and I wanted to give you a chance kind of. Even though there's no way. I want you to be able to at least take a swipe. Uh how many okay, they have one crushing hammer left. I like I like flexing my full art boss's orders. It, it 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 look it looks really nice. Like I have everything normal and then full art bosses. A normal Dedene. Who plays normal Dedene? This is so much better. This trainer toolkit art is so much better. There's a gold metal goggles, fancy. Why does everybody have fancier stuff than I do? It's not fair. Gold and metal goggles. Gold Zation Vs. Uh, normal Dedene GXs. <laughs> it's not fair. <laughs> Malo Lana. I can still not. I can still win. I just de delayed it by a turn. I'm gonna switch to the other Zation. I want to use the full art boss's orders, so I'm going to communication the Trubbish to grab my full art boss's orders, boss's orders, that gold Zation V, and then knock it out with my Toxtricity V Max. Purely because I want to use full art boss's orders again. <laughs> Wait, if I switch with boss's orders, well, uh, what was it again? Dust Island is in effect. Will that, uh, Will the poison switch or not? Because as an either player switches their poison Pokemon, their poisoned active Pokemon with one of their bench Pokemon with an effect of a trainer card. I don't think it would actually, because it says one of their Pokemon. I don't know if my. I'll have to ask that. There's the Intrepid Sword. Must use full art bosses again. Okay, Andrew C420, if you are watching this, now you know exactly all the weird plays I did in that game that we played. Right? Now you know exactly why. It's because my idle brain loves playing with fancy cards. Anyways, that's it for the video. I hope you enjoyed. Please consider dropping a like and subscribing. Anyways, see you in the next video, which truthfully might take a while. I don't really like to edit. And bye. Now I'm gonna go open up that, uh, open up that uncommon chest. Uh -huh. Reverse hello big charm. Boo.